Okay, here we are, aren't we, babe? Waiting, waiting. Well, we're waiting to board that ship over there, aren't we, babe? We think, we think we might be able to go to the mainland, don't we? Well, South Australia, yes. Well, South Australia. As long as we ride through Victoria, this boat hasn't uh, left the port for two days, though. So they had a bit of a scare, didn't they, sweetie? They did, and we're waiting, well, well, hoping to get a positive message. There's the bikes, nice and shiny, nice and clean. That's the last time you'll see them like that, guys. <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got a couple of cars lined up here now, haven't we? I didn't even know that one was behind us. Yeah, you pulled up. You've got, to get more, you've got to get more aware if we're going to the mainland <laughs> boat of what's coming behind you and around you and everything, OK? <laughs> yes, Dave. OK. Hope. Behind you. Oh, Jesus. So you've got to be aware. And this is going to happen for a month, guys, a month, isn't it? It's <laughs> so hey? exciting. What? It's exciting. But you're happy about we, it. We, what? Spending all that time with me. Well, <coughs> we're at the mainland <laughs> for 32 days, guys. I don't really know how I'm going to go. But it's been two years since we've been on it, isn't it, babe? Oh, so let's cross our fingers. And let's cross our fingers we don't get locked down when we go across to Adelaide. Okay, so we got movement. That's more than what they've had for a couple of days, isn't it, babe? <laughs> yeah. Apparently. Uh, Here he goes, nothing. Let you turn him off. No, nah, you should be right, babe. Here we go. Thanks, mate. Sorry? Do you have a booking number by any chance? Rego number? Uh, number. Uh, the, uh, what do you want? I can get it. Yeah, no. Up the top, the security. <laughs> okay. Really? okay, guys, guess what? We're not the going tonight. <laughs> <laughs> and they're fucking called security at us, and we know uh, nothing. <laughs> We're not, we're, they're going to let us out up the right up here, babe. Well, uh, well, what's happened is, because they haven't sailed two knots, seven minutes before they opened the gate, they were supposed to have sent a text out to say we were going at 8.30 in the morning. And we never got no text, and we are already in line anyway. Been a mess up, I believe. Sorry? You guys got no tickets? <laughs> oh, well, we did, yeah. They changed it. We're going tomorrow night now. No, well, babe, only one more night at home. But... Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, that's a nice balls up. <laughs> that woman was trying to hide her walkie-talkie because they were talking about us. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was loud. <sighs> oh, I but... didn't. Well, I wasn't angry or anything. No. God. All right, so, they called security. <laughs> they thought they were going to have problems with the bikers, didn't they? Yeah. Right, so what's going on, guys, is... We're going up there tomorrow night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I noticed you were getting a bit stinkly back there, babe. <laughs> okay, so we'll pull over. I'll wait till it's a little bit wider, babe. Okay? You there? You there? Babe? Are you there? Mesh intercom on. Mesh intercom on. You there, babe? Open mesh. You there? Channel one. Uh, what happened to the Bluetooth? Okay, so how much is the refund? Oh, that's nice. So we'll get... I think Kim might be on the phone till now. I think they might have actually rang her just after we left here. I think we're getting a refund. You there? We get a full refund on our trip over. So... We're getting all the money back. 400 and something dollars for the... Yeah. Yeah. Yep, four hundred and something dollars for this this cruise tonight that we didn't get tonight. Yeah. So it's free. As long as, as, long as we've still got a cruise over and over and back. She just said to me, she said, "Oh, look, um, 
we're sorry that we didn't text message you. She said, I understand you're in the lineup and you went through. I said, yeah. She said, look, we, we just couldn't get through everybody. She said, we had to end up calling calling people. Yeah. Um, she said, but look, tonight uh, the trip tomorrow is on us. She said, I understand they put you in for 8.30 in the morning. She said, but uh, that's now been changed to tomorrow night because it didn't suit you. Yeah. Yeah, yep. she said the lady beforehand too, the same thing. She was transiting straight through. Yeah. Yeah, so it wasn't going to... But anyway, she was really nice. Okay. And I uh, said, so they called security oh. on her. She said, oh, what for, to come down and help you out? And I said, no. I said, they thought my husband must have been going to go off at the young fella in the booth. She said, oh, I'm terribly sorry about that. She said, they shouldn't do that. <laughs> okay then, guys, you heard it. You heard it from the boss back there. <laughs> we're getting... We get, uh, we're getting a free trip over. <laughs> <laughs> well, she said that the the public health order gave the go-ahead. Yeah. Um, she said that unfortunately they just didn't have the room on the ship and they had to make some decisions. Yeah. Oh, look. Yeah. I just said to her, I said, well, look, it's not so bad. I said, um, there's probably other people in a worse situation. I said, we haven't got far to travel to go home. Okay, welcome, guys. You back there, babe? I'm here. Yes, we're coming up to take two. I'm getting, trying to get out of Tassie, aren't we, babe? Yeah. <laughs> to go down line. So we're coming up along uh, East Devonport in Tasmania at the moment, and we are about to head down towards the ferry terminal. As you remember, you might have seen the clip. Well, you probably, if you watched this video, you probably would have seen the clip, on the clip yeah. that we showed up for the boat on Sunday night, and... We were told they changed our um, crossing to the next morning, 8.30 the next morning, which is this morning. And they gave us seven minutes notice. Seven minutes notice. They reckon they sent a text out, but they didn't. We were in there trying to get our tickets to board. But anyway, it is what it is. Told them we didn't want that day crossing. You've got to get us on a night one. Because we do have to um, travel through Victoria, don't we, babe? Sure do. We've got to get out of Victoria as quick as we can. And because we're not allowed to stop. If you start giving them a hard time again, babe, God help you. Hey, I wasn't the one that had security called on me. Yeah, no, they did call security yesterday, didn't they, sweetie? Yep. They'll be going, oh, it's them again. Yeah. They'll have security out here ready. So, that there ticket box is, is where they told us yesterday, wasn't it, babe? <laughs> Not that one on the left there, but the one down there on the right. Straight through them gates there, isn't it, sweetie? But we're, look at this, we're first cab off the rank, aren't we? Yes. We've got to be the first ones to get kicked <laughs> off the fucking boat too, yeah. won't we? So the second attempt, waiting for the spirit of Tasmania for us to board. Will it happen or won't it happen? Look, the boat's not even in yet. That's where the boat lives. It's on a day crossing in the boat. Yeah, okay, the one that we were meant to be on. Yeah, we were supposed to catch it at 8.30 this morning, they said, didn't they? It wasn't going to work for us. It means we would have been getting off when it was dark in Melbourne and have to ride about 430 k's in the dark for our accommodation. It was not going to work for us. would have ended up with heaps of kangaroos on me, on my windshield, I reckon. There we go. There she is. She's rolling in for us, isn't it, babe? Wave to the captain. He's up there looking, baby. He's saying, oh, not them bikers. <laughs> not them again. OK, so here we go. We'll see if we get any further tonight, eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Heard the bike off this time. There you go, mate. I'll just turn that off, babe. How are you? Uh, Kim, yeah. Once you get on board, guys. Once you get on board. Uh, yeah. So these are your boarding passes and your cabin room key cards as well. Right. Thanks, mate. You all right? Yep. Well, we actually got tickets this time, babe. It's yay. <laughs> Can you have your boarding passes, please? Thank you. Just go straight down, and when you get to the orange bollard, just stop there, okay? Yeah, mate. Thanks. Stop yeah. when you get the orange bollard. <laughs> oh, that's a good, that's a good plan. Oh, well, we're a little bit further at the moment, babe. It's good advice. Yes. Stop when you get to the orange bollard. That's very good advice. 
He was asking for any weapons and stuff. I was going to say, only my vibrator. Um, some might say it's a weapon. You hear that, guys? It wasn't me, was it, eh, that said that? <laughs> no, it, it was it was someone else here, wasn't it, eh? Hey, that was not me. So you've got your vibrator with you, have you? I don't know. Oh, yeah, right. I'm just saying, because you packed my bags. Yeah. Okay, so we are a couple of steps further tonight, aren't we, sweetie? We've yeah. actually got tickets, and we're down in the line waiting now. As long as Russ doesn't go carrying on again. Here we go, here we go. We've been told to follow him. And I've got to get it. You're right. <sighs> You're right. Yeah. Okay, so we're moving, aren't we? Yep. Legs were frozen, that's why I couldn't get it get it off the stand. Oh, it's that not that cold, guys. We'll just sit down the bottom here and wait. I ain't putting that yep. much stress on the clutch. No. Wait till it clears up on top a bit. Yep. Yep. Yeah, she's right, babe. For anyone that hasn't been in the belly of the beast before, you're about to go in there, aren't they, babe? Yeah. Don't fall off. Don't look over the edge, sweetie. <laughs> no. If the wind blows now, you fuck, babe. We'll fall down and straight into that water and bang, babe, bang. I don't think we'll go bang. You're not, if you you want to get away from my bike, please? No, I don't want to look over the side. <laughs> There's no need to crowd me, though, babe. Now, just be careful. It's normally slippery. I know. The belly of the beast, guys. Where the fuck are we going, babe? No, we're nearly at the bloody front of the boat, aren't we? Yep. We've got to go in there. Yep. You go in the closest one or the furthest one? The closest. Oh, oh. Look, where in am here? I going? Where am I going, no, then? On the other side of me, alright? Just wait. It's in the middle of it. Just watch the side. Whoa, watch it, whoa. I expect you to leave the fobs on the bike for your alarms. Okay, We've we'll put them in transport mode. Alright, doesn't work. Just leave the fobs. Leave it in the bag? Yeah. yeah, leave them in the bag. Leave your fob in the bag, babe. It's allowed down here, okay, so it's all good. Right, okay. Five orange door, babe. Five orange. That's fine. And we've got to check in somewhere, too. Do we? Oh, well, we would have to. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, so we're going up and we're going to seven, babe. Okay? Yeah. So we're down in five, aren't we? Five orange. Okay, so we're in here, aren't we, babe? We're actually on board now, aren't we? Uh-huh. Down here, babe. Uh -huh. 7202, babe. You got me lost. I'm not fucking leading. Go back. Five, four, three, must be here. Yeah. Yep. Oh, is it? I might as well be. Oh. Seven to eight. Two. I've never been on the outside before, babe. We're in the linen closet. I'm lost already. Okay. Welcome to our home. We haven't got any direct neighbours. Can we? Well, we'll, be, we'll be able to make as much much noise as what we want to, won't we? We can party. We can party. Party with a hearty. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so this is our living quarters, isn't it, sweetie? Yeah. Okay. We'll catch you soon, guys. Okay, then, finally found our room. Now it's time to head down the lounge, have a little bit to drink, a little bit to eat. What are you into there, Kimmy? What? The salad. I bet that's the last salad you have on the road. Mm. Hey? I know. And to wash it down with, what have we got? A couple of mercs, haven't we, sweetie? Mm. A couple of mercs. Mm -hmm. This is down in the ship. Well, we're down, obviously, we're down close to the bar, aren't we, babe? Mm. Yes. Like the bar? It's real. There's not many people on board, is there? Hey? It's pretty vacant. It's pretty vacant. Might not recognise us. Might, it, might they both? Because we've got these masks on. When we're not drinking or eating, we've got to wear them, don't we, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Hey? Mm -hmm. Look at that. If I drink, if I just keep drinking... You'll be right. I won't have to wear a mask, will I? You can breathe. Mm -hmm. So, if you don't recognise us during our video footages, 
Trust us, it was us, one of the 20. Yep, sure eh? it is. Yeah, it, it is us. It does. See, we look like that without a mask. We look like that with a mask. See, yeah, see? Yeah. See, we... can you recognise us still? Wait, put it back on, mate. Mm. Is that Kimmy, or is that another woman I'm with? You wish. <laughs> <laughs> A quieter one, probably. A quieter one, yeah. Okay, guys, I'm filming on the phone down here because the SD card in the GoPro... Shit. ...took easy fit, didn't it, babe? Yep. Anyway, we'll catch you later, guys. So here we are, I'm looking out the window of the Spirit. We're docking... Well, you're too scared to go out there. ...docking in Melbourne. You're too scared to go out and film, are you? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> Someone might throw you overboard with the trouble you caused. Well, that's probably it, there. too. So this is inside the ship. That's pretty cool. There's Rusty there. He's having his brekkie. Didn't offer me a coffee. Anyway. You don't get when you ask, don't you, mate? You don't get if you don't ask. Oh, well, at least I know that now. I'll be asking for a lot later. <laughs> okay, so here we are. We're ready, aren't we, babe? We're, I'm leading. We're, you're leading. <laughs> God help us, heaven only knows where we're going to end up if she's leaving. I can tell you that right now, hey? So I think we're the only motorcyclists on board. I think we are. Are we the only one silly enough? We are. Okay. Look at old Dan there beside us. Do I? Dan. Yeah, old Dan there. I'll tell you what, I was just telling Kim, if I'd known Dan was down there yesterday, I would have slept down here with Dan. Yeah, and your baby. Yeah, with me baby in there. Probably some cider or beer or something. Yeah. What do you reckon? Yeah, yeah, unlimited. Had a peaceful night apart from her snoring, but it's all good. <laughs> it's all good. I'd rather be snoring than farting like you were. <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> we're off. And Melbourne turned on an okay morning, hasn't it, babe? Looks okay, yeah. Let's hope we can get to Adelaide without rain. Yeah. It's meant to be afternoon anyway. So here's the Westgate Bridge, guys, for who hasn't seen it before. It'll be longer than our Hobart Bridge, isn't it? Just slightly. Well, yeah, so we've been off the boat for an hour, haven't we, babe? We have. Yes. How many k's have we done? 28, 100 k's. Yeah. And we're coming up to the little town of Inverley in Victoria. We gather it. The town had the sign saying in the lead, didn't it? Well, maybe we blinked. <laughs> no, 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 no. Well, then we got something up here because we're back to 60, babe. Oh, yeah. We're not stopping, though. Put a skate park there if you want to get your Harley on, do it. Oh, no. look at that nice hotel, babe. Yeah. They're beautiful old town. Look at that, guys. Ooh. This is in the lead. Bakehouse there. Sorry, mate. We'd like to stop, but we're not allowed. They won't let us, will they, babe? We'll get into too much trouble. Yeah, we're on a timeline here. We do have to get out of Victoria as quick as we can. Okay, so we're coming into Mortlake. Mortlake is an historic settlement which lies at the base of Mount Shadwell, an extinct volcano. It is located 216 kilometres west of Melbourne via the Hamilton Highway and 49 kilometres north east of Warnham. And this is where we're going to um, fuel up, isn't it, babe? Yep. Somewhere here we are. <laughs> this should be our only stop for fuel and our only, virtually our only stop in Victoria, unless we stop on the side of the road for a drink somewhere. All we need is a servo though, don't we, babe? That's it, BP. Well, I think so, yes. And a letter 9191 Ultimate. Ultimate, that's what we want. Mm -hmm. Turn them right down here somewhere, babe. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a T intersection. Well, Henry's really done it to us again this time, haven't they, babe? <laughs> he took us yeah. on a whole country back road. Yeah, he loves well, his back roads. Yeah, we've been on that for 10 or 12 k's. I don't know what he thinks sometimes. And for anyone that don't know, Henry's our GPS. He wants Kimmy Russ Adventures to go on an adventure. A fucking adventure. I'll give him an adventure going off on fucking roads like that. Throw him in the bushes, mate. I might as well take it up fucking Mount Everest if I'm going to go on roads like that. <laughs> OK, here we are. We are at Wolves. Uh, Bulls for here in Victoria, aren't we, babe? 
Yeah, and apparently it's a shithole. Oh, that, that, they've got that written on the toilets in there. We've just stopped for a toilet break, haven't we, sweetie? Yeah. Right there. There's the shitter there. But this is Wolf's fault. Not much here. But we've just stopped, haven't we, bud? And um, had a little, gonna have a little drink. Yeah. Then we gotta continue on to Mount Gambia because we've got to get out of Victoria. Yeah. We've been riding for about the last 240 k's before we stopped the fuel, didn't we? Yeah. So we'll see how we go. So we'll catch you on down the road. Yep. Will we not? We will. Okay, so we're coming up the South Australia border and there's supposed to be a border checkpoint up here somewhere. So we're about to find out whether we're going to get in or not, I guess. If we're not, we're screwed. <laughs> Aren't we, babe? Yeah, we don't even have a tent to pitch. Nah. So our passes should be in our border. What's the name's in that folder? Yep. Just up there. There you are, mate. One more when you're ready. Oh. You're right. You there, babe? Hello. Oh, shit, you're loud. You there? Yeah, I am now. <laughs> All right. What was wrong? Why couldn't you find your e pass? Oh, fucking, I had nothing. I, I couldn't get any internet net connection, any oh. phone connection. He said to me you wouldn't get it here. I got mine. Yeah. That's what he said. Oh, you should have downloaded it on your phone. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, we're through. Yeah. Okay, no. guys. So, we're in South Australia, aren't we? They let us through. I don't know if that's a good thing or not, eh, bud? No. That's good for us at the moment. They were quite relieved when they seen the Tassie number plates, though. Yeah. But there, there is one thing interesting, it is going to rain for us sometime or other. <laughs> well, we're nearly at Mount Gambia anyway now. Yeah, so we're only 10 k's from Mount Gambia now. I said, the guy said, oh, so where did you come from this morning? And I said, well, we got off the ship this morning. And he goes, oh, he goes, you've travelled right through. He said, that's a big day for you. I said, yeah, and I'm bloody hungry. <laughs> <laughs> what did he say? You've got to eat down the road here. He said, yeah, just eat down, a, down the road. Be able to get something to eat down the road here, he said. Yeah. Okay, Kimmy, we made it to South Australia, didn't we? Mount Gambia, the second largest city in South Australia, is recognised as the jewel of the state's southeast region. It is an important rural centre which is characterised by a number of attractive historic buildings and major attraction of the Blue Lake. The city's primary appeal lies in exploring the lakes and sinkholes, unique and remarkable formations, as well as admiring the impressive number of significant historic buildings. We will look at this in the next episode. Yeah. And we've just been into Macca's. Yes, I know, guys, I know, I know. We go to Macca's a bit. But don't forget, we've not eaten. We got up off the boat at quarter past eight this morning, haven't eaten. We've just rode straight through to South Australia. So I think we're allowed, aren't we, babe? And it's not just any old Macca's, it is a South Australian Macca's. Yeah, that's right. With the number plate front. And that'd be typical, wouldn't it? First one as soon as we hit the border. <laughs> hey, so we'll go and find out a, a place of abode for the night, won't we, babe? Oh, hang a left here, eh, babe? Sure. What do you reckon? Do it. We're going straight across. Oh, yeah, because there's the green Yeah, it's just down there. It's just down across. there. Yep, across the road. I can see the sign from here. Does it say the Grand Central? Is it ours? I no, Mid City. Okay. Over the road from that. Here's yep. the back streets of Mount Gambia, guys. Mount Gambia's main street's just down there on the right. And our motel room is just down here. On the left. We have stayed here previously at the Mid City Motel in Mount Gambia. We find the location just right for us. It's over the back of the main street. Everything is in walking distance. The rooms are well appointed too. Family rooms just about fucking need that to fit us in there. We're a family? We're a family. Have a look at us. Okay then. <laughs> so we're in number 12. Yeah, put the bikers down the back, babe. Right there. 
This is our abode for the night, and you see, you see two that? Two nights. Well, oh, for two nights, yes. Yeah. And, and that thing down there, that's where we'll be sitting having fucking stubbies, won't we, babe? I'm going to get them. Will we not? Did they stock our fridge for us or not? I don't reckon, babe. I didn't ring ahead. I rang for head, but I didn't ring ahead. <laughs> yeah, you ever say that? Yeah, yeah. There you go. I'll go and open up our boudoir. Hey. Okay. This is us. Oh, Kim's got a fucking single bed. <laughs> no friends over. Oh, we've got a kitchen and everything in here. You'll be cooking tonight. G'day, 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 guys. How you going? <laughs> We're on holidays, aren't we? I'll tell you what now. I'll tell you what. If you don't want to see nothing from us on Facebook, you better unsubscribe right now, yeah. then, mate, mate. Right now. Or I tell blockers. You, you get all blockers, one of the two. If you don't like seeing our shit, be gorgeous. It's going to come thick and fast in the yeah. bay, mate. So we're in Mount Gambier for a couple of nights. It's going to come in and rain. Oh, I know you're saying, we're on holidays. Sucked on you. Well, we're on holidays. Where are you guys? <laughs> Probably still working. Probably still working, eh? Hey? But anyway, this is our complex for the night. And we've got a nice little unit over there, haven't we? Should I take them over? Should I should I go over and show them the unit? Yeah, do it. I'll, I'll take them for a walk, eh? Hey? Don't just... get us too many other shenanigans in here. Just do it. <coughs> shenanigans. Who the hell would do shenanigans, eh? Hey? Who's on holidays again, eh, yeah. hey, babe? Guess who's happy again? Who? You. You. <laughs> always happy. Oh, Rusty's always happy. Tell me if I'm not happy and I'll be happy. Yeah, you'd be happy. <laughs> we have left Tassie and had to drive straight through Mount Gambia, having, uh, straight through to Mount Gambia in South Australia, not stopping in Victoria. Apart from petrol, isn't it? Yes, that's all we did. Yes, that's all we did. Yep. And that was about a 430 kilometre ride, got off the boat about... 8.15 or so this morning, didn't we? And we got and, here at... Oh, 1.30? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Somewhere about there. Some... Oh, and Henry, he took us on an adventure, didn't he? And if anybody don't know, Henry is the GPS, isn't he, babe? Yeah. He took us on an adventure up back roads, narrow laneways. And... But, you know what, we got here. In the end, I was that fucking lost. I thought, I said to Kim, I said, I hope Henry knows where he's going because yep. I haven't got a fucking Just clue. Put full-on trust in that GPS. Yep. And he yeah. got his ear, And we he, were yeah? up a narrow track, up a narrow track, and we had to pull over for that semi that came through. Yeah, we did have to pull off the road for a semi that came mm. through, yes. But never mind, we're here, aren't we, mm. hey? Yeah. So we're in Mount Gambia for two nights. It's going to come in and fucking rain tomorrow, by looks of And for the next few days. Yeah, we could be well, here yeah, we're already sucking down the piss, aren't we, babe? They'll get sick of us and kick us out. They'll say, no. Nah. And you'll do this. I'll take them for a tour, babe. They'll say, Victoria, you need these people. They'll put us in lockdown. Dazza, have you got a spare bed? <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, this is our room for the night. I'll just show you. Here's young Kimmy there. Yeah, look, yeah, no, you can, yeah, you got sucking two stubbies. On both. Yeah, sucking on both of them. It's, it's, it's not much of a room, but we call it home, don't it's we? It's home babe? for a couple of days. <laughs> it's home for a couple of days. We've got the more gons of a telly. As always, we've always got a mess, haven't we, babe? Yep, big coaster there, look at that. Yeah. Big yep, yep, okay. So there's old Rusty there in the mirror. And we've got a bathroom. We've even got a bathroom here, eh? And, oh, <laughs> of course we got the fucking shitter too, haven't we, eh? We got a shower. Nice big mirror there. Oh, relax. It's just nice being on holidays, isn't it, eh? And then, the best thing about this, babe, what do you oh, got I'm in the bag? I'm just showing you what's in my bag. Nothing exciting in that bag. No. I'll have to go look at them, won't I? I've got a few bags. Oh, yeah. yeah. Th these are all the bags here. But this is our little kitchenette air corn up there. Kim can even cook bloody tea tonight. We've got everything. <laughs> well, Full thing of bloody stubbies there. we got, we got cutlery. Look. we got... Oh, my fucking God. These rooms come with them things now, babe. Look. Look, babe. Look. That's why it's not in my bag. <laughs> they come with them things. Look. That's why it's not in my frickin' bag. Is that yours? <laughs> in the cutlery drawer. Well, oh, babe, I got to I stick it in your bag, the way I Anyway, enough of that. That, um, that there is a room, I don't know. Darren Sale, are you behind that door? 
Is he, babe? Russ, look what I found in your undies. Oh, 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 oh geez. Oh, she's not as she's funny. She's Dazzler, isn't she? Yeah. No, hey, Karen's What fine. are the chances, babe? What are the chances? Dazzler. No, nah, he's not in there. No. No, nah, he's not in there. But anyway, look at this. Look at this. It's 4.30 in the afternoon and she's got the freaking door. <laughs> We don't know the area. Don't know the area. <laughs> We've only been here a couple of times. Eh? It was a couple of years ago, though. There's the babies out there. Ah, you see the sky starting to cloud over. Some storms are I, coming. I like these motels that give you all this because what? when we get older and we get on the pension and it's off pension week, We've got coffee, sugar, tea, biggies. You're fucking well near there now. Shampoo. You're near there now, babe. Pension <laughs> week. Pension. Hey. Oh, no, yeah. off pension week. I've been trying to pension you out for years. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, it won't be long putting up with you. No, it won't be. Anyway, we must go. We must have some drinking to do, I'm sure. Well, we've only got half an hour drinking time because we're going to go for tea. Oh, yes, we've got to go to tea. We've thing. booked into three places and we're just going to do a meal run. Yeah, she's got a point there. We don't know which one we're going to no. yet, but anyway, not to worry. Just sitting here thinking, she'd make a fucking good beer bitch, this woman. Here she comes, look. <laughs> she's coming out now with beer and jackets. Look at this. Yeah, so anyone that wants her, 0408. 906 735. Anyone at all that wants it for a beer bitch, contact that number, okay? What are you Look at this. Look at this. I'm just I'm just giving them the phone number. If anyone wants a good oh. beer bitch, baby. Oh, that's nice to say that about me. Thanks. Ooh. Uh, and you know is, I said it about you. It's a compliment. I'm just oh, it's a good. Yeah. I'm not cold. Why you got me a jacket? Because if I'd have come out without yours and I've got mine on, you would have said, man, you fucking here is mine. No one looks Excuse after me. me. It's not Kim here, it's Russ. It's, it, that's you that says that. Oh, where's mine? You would have said, no one looks after me. No one ever looks okay. after me. But I did, a good beer see? bitch she is. A good beer bitch. We're yeah. on the side of trail tonight. She hasn't got much else going for her. But she's a good beer bitch. I'm OK to holiday with her, aren't yeah, I? Yeah, no, she's not too bad. Yes. I mean, you know, when I sit here and think about it, She's not too bad. Yeah, not. Yeah. It could be worse for me, couldn't it, eh? Yeah. I could have to go and get him myself. Yes. Yeah. So anyway. That's right. You know, got to appreciate and what you got. You know how you said there was not very many PowerPoints in that room? Yeah. I discovered there's a full-on power board. <gasps> We've got a power board yeah. for our electricals. It's got five things in the power board. We've always got an electrical nightmare when we pull up. Yeah, we there's so many things that you can use in there. There's plugins everywhere. Should be out of charging, won't you, tonight? Yeah, that's all right. <laughs> hey, Can't you let it go? Can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling. We could get